Hello everybody, Evil Demon Master, and welcome back to another video. So, in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to unlock your legendary cloak for patch 8.3. Now, if anyone's coming back to the game, or just recently just came back and want to play the new patch for 8.3, well, this video is for you. So, I'm gonna show you how to unlock your legendary cloak. So, to get started, when you first log, log in, there's a quest that should pop up. It's called uh, Return of the Black Prince. And we need to speak with Verissa Saringer at the Great Seal. And she is standing right here. So Let's if you talk to her, tell me what you saw. And here we go. You mean to tell me none of your spies have returned? Nizoth is out there, and we need answers now! We are doing all we can. Speaker Magni is coming, along with a new... advisor. He claims to have information for us. By the light. A new advisor. <clears throat> Rathian. Anduin. It's been so long! I suppose I deserved that. Oh, you deserve more than that. My father is dead because of you! And my father is dead because of the old gods. Lad, he's come to help us. Notharian the Earth Warder was once the protector of Azeroth. But Nazoth turned a noble mind to madness, and now my father is only remembered as Deathwing. And, as I haven't the least desire to share that fate, I've been studying how to avoid it. Just tell me how to prepare for this attack. Our armies will be useless. Nazoth will strike here. He'll manipulate emotions, get people to act in ways contrary to their nature. You won't be able to trust your senses, your memories, your friends. After all, what is real if our perceptions can be trusted? Anduin! 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 Don't you see, old friend? It's already begun. Very well, advisor. Tell us how to stop him. So after that cutscene from a cinematic, you get to uh, be back, come back here, my loyalty and then for my complete own. the quest. And we need to meet with Magni Brownsby at the team of four. All right, so let's go. Alright, so the Chamber Heart is in the Sithris and it's waiting in this portal. So click in the portal and we'll have to go see Magni in the Chamber of Hearts. Alright. So now we're in the Magni's encampment. Going to st uh, Titan. And then we go over here and talk to Magni. Uh, and you and spies couldn't you find the Zoth. Have you had any luck yourself? My Black Talon operatives have scoured the world to no avail. I wonder. In my research, I came across references to a place called Nyalotha, a sleeping city of numberless crimes, where only dark things walk. But the void deals it's in potentials, away. possibilities. Perhaps this Nyalotha is not so much a physical location on Azeroth as it is a vision waiting to be made real. Whatever it is, we've got to get Azeroth's Titan made defenses ready. Then you and our champion need to find us a target to point them at. 
Okay, now it should be okay. Yeah, they're done talk talking. All right, go well, pack Magni and activate the Titan console in the Chamber of Hearts. Okay. Our mother has connected the Chamber of Hearts to all known Titan facilities on Azeroth. First things first. Let's make sure they're all working as intended. Okay, so we gotta activate one. Accessing facility. Designation, Old Year. Facility dormant. Residual old guide corruption within acceptable parameters. Given how much corruption it used to have, I'd say that's good news! Alright, and then we activate the second one. Accessing facility. Designation, Oldermon. Discs of Norganon intact. Records of unauthorized access not found. It is not knowledge that Nazoth seeks. The rise of Nyalotha would erase all that we once were. Alright, and... Oh, my boy. And then we hit... Another one. Accessing facility. Designation, Ulduar. Forge of Wills currently operational. Communication protocol terminated by Keeper Mimoron. And finally, the last one. Accessing facility. Designation, Uldum. Error. Forge of Origination currently inactive. Inactive? What happened to it? Unable to determine root cause of deactivation. I think we can all safely assume what this root cause might be. This is not good. So before I begin, this is Rathian's new design. So he looks a little different from Mr. Pindera, last time we saw him. But yeah, he's a lot different this time. So, uh, let's begin with uh, to to go. So we we'll talk to Manny again. I speak for Complete Azeroth. the quest, and we need to meet Magni at Udom. Back to work. All right, so I'll meet you guys over there. All right, so I am now in Udom. Once you arrive, you will have to go over there. And you have to go meet Magni, go here. And Magni should be somewhere with, with there he is, right there. Over here, champion. I think I found who took control of the forge. Azeroth All cries right. out in pain. Defeat the okay. So we're going inside the dungeon. Remember your duty. I'll return to the chamber. And start figuring out our next move. So this this dungeon. Can afford to lose the forge again. Do whatever it takes to protect it. Okay, so who's gonna meet me inside that dungeon? Now, as I was just saying, this is halls of organization. This is a uh, cataclysm dungeon. So now we get to go back again, and get. That's how you. Uh, it's part of the quest line for the cloak. Alright, so now we're inside the dungeon. Stage one. Oh, it's been ages since I've held a hammer in my hands. Feels good to be back in the action. Alright, so we gotta kill some Intruders! You dare defile this place with the curse of flesh? Yeah, we have to defeat these guys again. You stand before the Amethyst! Nope. Looks like we'll have to fight our way through. Let's get moving. Alright. So now we need to uh, climb the stairs. Kill some more of those guardians.
good. Alright, we're good. Alright, uh, you can choose any st uh, path you want, but we're gonna go this way. We got lots of enemies. So we need to uh, kill. Oh, there's a couple more we're gonna kill. All right, and dead. All right, now we're here. We got more to kill. So what we need, uh... Wait. See those statues? The Amethet must have reactivated the forge's defenses. Alright, so we need... We'll have to turn them off before we can cross. The controls should be down below. Alright, let's keep killing these guardians until we get to the bottom. Go. Alright, and then go over here. So what we need to do is to uh, activate the forge consoles. So there should be, I think there's two on each side. Okay, so let's take out this guy. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's one. Is another? Yep, no, yeah. that was right. There is one on each side. Alright. Let's take this guy out. Alright. Activate that. There we go. Okay, climb the stairs. And then we gotta t uh, turn around, go the other way, and do the same thing on the other side. Deactivate the other two. And hopefully, there should something spawn in the middle once they are deactivated. Alright, so we're gonna go uh, down here. Ooh. Okay, so you can't go in the middle because watch. If you go in the middle, that's why. Those things will actually kill you. So do not go in the middle. You have to go left and right. Let's take this out. Dead. All right, so what we need to do is go the same thing on the other side. Take these guys out. Deactivate those consoles. All right, let's take this one out. Okay, might need some healing. Go. All right, let's take these guys out. And they're dead. There we go. Deactivate that one. Deactivate that. Done. That's all of them. Onward now. Alright, so since those four are now deactivated, now we can across the middle. That's how you get across by deactivating those four consoles. Alright, so now since both of them are deactivated, we can start walking towards this way. The forge is ours, trespassers. Now we got more enemies to kill. That's good, that's good. You. 
And dead. Alright, that's done. Alright, let's move on. Alright, now this is another one. There's a couple more enemies. Good. So we got four more enemies to kill. Let's take you out. Dead. Alright, move on to another one. Take this one out. Alright, dead. Let's kill the last two. That's one, and then. The watcher is not yet complete. I need more time. Our enemies are already upon us. Activate it. Alright, and then after the last, last one, we got a uh, mini boss to kill. Well, he's only like 21%, so it's kind of easy to kill now since he's only half dead. So it should be simple. Just gotta kill it and then it's dead. Unauthorized life forms detected. Commencing purge. Oh, that doesn't he sound good. Alright, stick out. I don't think it attacks you. But this cast that though, so it's almost dead anyways. And dead. See? Easy. Forge compromise. Gamathet can make their own watchers. We'll have to worry about that later. Come on, let's take the lift up to the control chamber. Alright. What the Power's been shut off. Hang on, I'll get us access to the conduits. All right, stage five. Now I'm going this way. This way, champion. All right, now we just gotta go this way and go over here. Now we got a bunch of more enemies to kill. Look! Some of the consoles here are still active! If we can figure out which one controls the lift, we can reroute power to it and get it working again. Alright, so we got tons of enemies we need to kill. So we have to, like, go on each side to uh, activate one of them. So let's go this way. And there's gonna be... Okay, there's only two, so that's good. It's a good thing you get Magni by your side to help you out. Alright, dead. Let's kill this one. Okay. Ah, this is the lift's console. If we reroute the power here, we can get her running. Okay, let's look at this. Uh, we're not gonna read that. Okay, that's one. We need to activate... I think... No, we just need the forge to be activated, that's all. Alright, so that's done. Let's go up here now. Let's take this guy out. Dead. Go up here. Yeah. 
And there's about four enemies up here we can need to take out. Dead. There we go. Take this guy out. Dead. So some of these uh, creatures are actually easy to kill when you try and get the cloak. Alright, dead. Alright, let's take a look at this. Norganon Data Archive. Must be where all of the forge's diagnostics are stored. Alright, that's done. Now we got two more to go. And it should be all deactivated. I mean, not deactivated, but like back on. Alright, so now let's go this way. We can also activate the power console too. All right, now let's go up here. Kill these guys. All right, that's dead. And that's dead. Where they're powering the defenses we encountered earlier. We can shut this one off. And finally we go up there and then everything should be all done, I hope. So let's go up here, take those dudes out. This guy out. And there we go. Reorigination. Back away slowly now. Best not to be messing with that. Okay, that should no, that's not all. We need to uh Deactivate those power consoles now. So let's take this one out. Actually, there's two of them. There we go. And to take you out. You're dead. Alright, so now we need to click on this one. Alright, that's done. Click on this. Nope, we can't click on that. Let's click on this one. Okay. Now we can click on this one. This one. Done. And finally, the last one. Ok, 
Okay, did I do it? Wait. Uh, okay, something must be missing. Let's kill these guys real quick. So they can be out of my way. Guys, and uh, all right. So let's free this out now. We need to somehow. Uh, Unless I got them all. Okay, so there should be another one. Maybe if we go over here. Mm. Nope, doesn't doesn't do anything. So it's something with those four consoles that you have to do. No, that just turns. That goes that way. Okay, now those ones. Now, okay, that activates. So we have to we have to do like some kind of puzzle. Does that match? No. Uh. Is there anything up here I can. Nope, nothing up there. Okay, how about we go this way? I believe we have to match all of them to get the. Uh, to work. No. Uh, okay, so that didn't work. These stones have tales to tell. Oh, that's just okay. Nope. Okay, so we have to like somehow to activate. I don't think it's supposed to go that way, right? Okay, did I shut it off? I don't think I did. Okay. I'm not sure this is. I don't think it's bugged. You just have to like match the until you get the console to work. So this is gonna be a while. Okay, so we need to uh, activate the power. No, that's mm. ah, why do they have to make this contraption so convoluted? Mother, we're not having any luck rerouting the power. Can you have a go from your end? Establishing remote interface. Stand by. Access granted. Rerouting power from defensive grid. Lift status operational. Okay. Flesh cursed. Your kind are unworthy of the Titan's gifts. So after you uh do some stuff in here like 
just I think you have to wait for a while until it's until you uh when that uh, when uh when he talks and then you can finally move on to the next stage. So it probably takes a while to do it. Alright now I'll get to kill this guy. Alright, and get all my power and see if we can you kill him. This place long enough. Fall before the Time and again, you have failed to protect the Titan's works. Now you will burn! Oh, science that got science that for healing. There we go. Okay, now he's an old guy. Oh, okay. No, I, I feel this one, I mean. He's almost dead, though. He's dead. the forge and this is worse than we thought we have to hurry come on all right so after that we gotta go back now and then we gotta go that way and do something else over there I think we need we need to uh, take the elevator since it's fixed now. All right, so we stand over here. Go to the lift. Looks like the lift is working. The control chamber should be on the third floor. All right, so we're gonna take the third floor, and here we go. Up we go. There we are. Here we are. I'll contact the Chamber of Heart. Connection received. Please confirm elimination of hostile entities. We took care of them, but not before Nazoth gave the Forge a beating. Understood. Access power terminals to commence system reactivation. Alright, so we need to activate four of the power. So here's one. And here's another one. Actually, no, it's just two, not four, just two. And done. Receiving signal. Error. Unable to access primary power conduits. Direct circuit to Chamber of Heart required. Interface Heart of Azeroth with main console. Alright. Now we need to activate these two. Not just that. Circuit established. Restoring power. Error. Four 
Research operating at 37% efficiency. 37? That can't be enough to keep Azeroth protected! Affirmative. Additional power sources required. Initiating query for suitable alternatives. Stand by. It looks like your work isn't done, champion. Okay. Well met! Meet King first and Wemmerkin. I'll return to the chamber and start figuring out our next move. Alright, so Marinese. Can't gonna... afford to lose the forge again. Do whatever it takes to protect it. Alright, so who's gonna leave? And then we can uh, teleport out to this dungeon by going stepping inside here. There we go. And then we head out to the dungeon and then we have to meet up with uh we have to go meet King first and Wemmerkin. Alright. Exit the dungeon. Okay, now we can get out of here. And now we get to, uh... Listen to the King. Okay, gotta get my mouth. And then we go all the way back to Ramekin. And we gotta talk to King Ferris, who's in charge of this. I think he's also, when the Cataclysm came out, I think he's also been there too. So I'm not... I don't remember though. Probably though. So yeah, once you finish everything and you get your cloak, uh, there's gonna be some phases that you can do and do some dailies that's gonna be co-opted to you. Alright, so here I am. I'm now in Ramekin. Let me uh, repair and then we can move on. There we go. Alright, go here and... Brigands, your kind are not welcome here. We come unarmed, and we only seek an audience with the king. It would seem you are not the only ones. Alright, talk to this guy. How may Ram Gahan aid you? Learn the threat, Scott. Farewell, traveler. Click on the sands and listen. We know little of the Amethet, save that they believe themselves the sole defenders of the Titan's great works. In their eyes, all others are corrupted by the curse of flesh, and are enemies of the Makers. It is imperative that they be kept away from the Forge. To the west, another threat looms. Terrible monstrosities have emerged from the sands and gather in great numbers. Though we suspect they hail from on Karage, they are unlike any Karaji or Silithid we have faced before. And worst of all, our priests are plagued by unrelenting nightmares. They see our cities burning to ash and our people turning against each other. I fear that these visions are but the harbinger of something far more dire. We must prepare ourselves for disaster. So let's say a little cutscene you get to see. Alright, so now we we'll talk to this guy. You may speak. I will join you. It is clear that Ramkahan cannot face these menaces alone. I propose an accord with those here today that we band together and defend our home. You cannot be serious. I will not partner with grave robbers and bandits. You will obey your king. All who would fight for Uldum are allies of Ramkahan. The Waste Wanderers stand with you, King Feoris. The League's got your back too. Very well. Together. 
we will vanquish all who threaten our home. For old doom. Oh, okay. Do you bring news? Alright, so all we have to do for this, this also includes to, uh, to, to get your cloak is you have to complete the assault. And you get a, a new uh, ensigns for doing this at level 1. And you get some other power as well. Our power is in our people. Okay, and then what's he has to offer? Show me the current assault. Enough chatter. Alright, so there's a daily we can do too. With each passing day, new enemies descend upon Uldoom. We must drive them from the sands. Strike so them down wherever possible. But focus on key objectives and enemy champions to deal the most damage. So I'm gonna do this assault. So that way you guys don't have to see this. But I'll let you know when it's 100%. And then I'll, can turn it, and then I'll let you guys know when I'm done. Alright, so I finished the bonus objective. And then after you get the bonus objective to 100, you have to kill the commander and after that's done you can turn the quest in and this should do it for the to continue so let me uh see if this is it all right i'm gonna turn us in good to see you remember you can adapt to anything all right done and you get some new treasure too seek out the chamber of hearts. Got it. And I got some corruption gear too. Awesome. Hey, uh. Okay, I guess that's good. All right, so now we get to go back to the chamber of heart. Well, first of all, let me turn this quest in. And then we can uh, go back to the gym of hearts. So yeah, there's like some quests and dailies you can do after you uh, get started with the cloak. And you may want to start doing them every day because that is how you get some of the class of visions. You might need a uh, need that to buy vessels so you can do the visions to upgrade your cloak by wink to wink It starts at level 1 and then it goes to 15. That's the maxed for f that's that's the max for the cloak is 15 All right, so let me turn this in Hail adventurer Champion Mother may have found a way to restore the Forge of Origination. Meet us at the Chamber of Heart as soon as you can. Alright. So what we need to do is go to the Chamber of Hearts. Alright, we're now gonna get out of here. And then I'm gonna take the portal to go to the Chain of Hearts right now. Alright. Go over there. And now we gotta go talk to go here first. Alright. And now we're back to the Chim of Heart. Speak to, uh... You're back! Let's hear what Mother has to say. Alright. Forge operating at reduced capacity. Recommendation. Reroute power from compatible Titan facilities. So the fort was not damaged beyond repair. How fortuitous. It is unlike Nazoth to resort to brute force. All of the other forges are working full time to protect Azeroth. Is there anywhere else we can get that power? Schematics indicate compatibility between Forge of Origination 
and engine of Nalak Shah. That's it then. Looks like we're heading to Pandaria. Okay. So I'm just, this is new new entrance, by the way. Alright, uh, we don't need that. It's junk. Alright, so now talk to Magni. I speak for Azeroth. Meet at uh Kona Summit. Fight for our world. I'll meet you at the entrance to the vaults, champion. It seems our fates are intertwined. Never let your guard down. Alright, talk to the mother. There's something else we need to talk to. Accessing database. Hello. Okay, we uh, did you act? No, we gotta, uh, talk to her. Experimentation? We, we get to cleanse corrupted with the items now. Farewell protocol. There we go. Alright, so now we need to go back to Pandaria to Kunhai Summit to begin the next adventure to get the cloak. So I'll meet you guys in Kunhai Summit. Alright, so now I'm in Kunhai Summit, and this is where you need to go, right here. This is where I need to meet Magni, so this is where we need to go, way right over here. Alright, here we are. Careful, hero. One of these Mogu is still kicking. Honored speaker, I would have words with you. You what? Well, that's peculiar. Alright, talk to him. Lead the way. We must make haste. The mantid gone. Foolish Moku. These vaults now belong to the Empress. I need to get closer. Your allies will die with you. And then Mag just stands and watches while I do the work. So no help for him. Oh now he helps. Bring the Mr. Mogu. Alright. Hmm. If this Mogu's clan is anything like him, maybe they'd be willing to help us. I don't know the first thing about Mogu clan sigils, but I bet Lord Walker Cho does. I'll meet you at the seat of knowledge. Alright. So now we gotta go to the Vow of Eternal Blossom, which is over there. So I'll meet you guys at the Vow. Alright, so now I'm in the Vow of Eternal Blossom, and we need to go over there, so I'm almost there, and here we are. Okay, we're gonna go up here, and here we go. Alright, here's our good buddy. Ah, champion! Just as new dangers threatened Pandaria. Her heroes make a triumphant return. This will surely be a tale to remember. But enough prattling. How can I help? So yeah, our good boy Loaka Cho from Pandaria. We get to meet him again. Greetings. Alright, discover the organs. Every good story needs a hero. As you know. The Mogu clans were once again united by the resurrected Thunder King, Lei Shen. After his defeat, the Mogu splintered and began warring for dominance. Many new clans arose from the ashes. 
Perhaps this sigil belongs to one of them. Let's begin our search with my copy of The Serpent Masters. Alright, so we gotta find his book. Which is right here. With their command over Storm and Serpent, many consider the Zantian the dominant clan. Though the others surely disagree. However, I see nothing pertaining to our mysterious sigil. Perhaps my copy of Power to Blood holds the answer. Alright, the next one is right there. Masters of Blood Magic, the Dokani bolster their ranks with powerful war machines fueled by the life essence of those they conquer. This looks nothing like the sigil though. See if you can find a copy of Will of Stone. Alright, and then another book right there. It's too far away. Stubborn and prideful, the Baruch used the spirits of the dead to animate the statues littering their ruins and turn them into immortal soldiers. The sigil does not appear here either. Could it be we've not encountered these mogul before? Wait. There is one more tome we could search. Bring me a copy of The Origins of the Mogu. And that would be right over there on the bookshelf. I'm out of range. There you go. Originally, the Mogu served the Titans as builders and guardians. Those who answered to High Keeper Raden were known as the Rajani. Remarkable. This sigil matches that of the Rajani. Is it possible that this ancient clan has been resurrected? And what of Raden? Alright, and that's over with. Clark the Mogul's gun report. I'll stay with the Lord Always Walker and ask what he knows about the vaults. Good luck with the Mogu. Alright, so that is way up there. So we got to uh, kill some mogus and see if it drops. So what we're looking for is a, a mogu scouting report. So we need to collect a report by killing a bunch of mogus over there. So this might take a while to get it dropped, maybe a couple kills. Yeah, there's a uh, Yulon. It was also from Pandaria. All right, so let's kill some Mogu now. All right, so let's kill this guy. Let's see if he drops. Oh, look, another one has joined the show. Drop. Yeah, all right, nothing dropped. So yeah, this is gonna take a while until it drops. Might need to uh I don't know, but it just takes a while to, to drop though. And I'm stunned. Okay. Oh. 
Oh, sweet. There we go. A thousand more will take his place. Alright, and then we go back to the... Where I came from. Talk to Lord Walker Cho. And then, uh... After that, we gotta go to... Kunai Summit. Go to the dungeon. And that's where we begin some kind of research. Alright. So there's Law Walk of Cho, which is in over here. Alright, uh, here you go. Pandaria welcomes you. Farewell. You found the Rajani. Excellent. Let's just hope they'll put down their spears long enough to hear us out. Now talk to Magni. Azeroth cries out Meet with in pain. the sun sex away. For Azeroth! Alright, so what we need to do... We go over there. And we need to, uh... Meet with somebody over there. I believe that's where we get to see Wild Dan over there. Now, Wild Dan is also a raid boss. In Son of Thunder back in Pandaria for uh Son of Thunder Raid. Now he's back in Battle for Azeroth and he's also a raid boss again, but he's corrupted. So now we have to kill him. Alright, so we have to to uh, find this uh place. You go over here and then the new thing this is the new stuff right here, this is all new. So we got a bunch of statues you can Outsider. use. Your kind are not welcome here. Is that how you address the speaker of Azeroth? The speaker? What is the meaning of this? Okay, before we do that, so we got a bunch of statues you can use. You can use this guy. Uh I think it's the tank, I believe. You have the Wait, huh, I'll show you what it looks like. So, it's like, it's the rhino. We got... The, the tiger. Which you can transform into. So that's pretty cool. And then we got the... Dragon, Yulon. Which looks like that. And then we got the... Uh, TGI, which are uh, this is uh, actually a good one because it can keep you healed for two percent. And if you die, you can come back too. All right, so let's begin. Cutscene. As you have seen, the Mantid have begun to swarm. I did not realize they had grown so bold as to invade Moldershan forts. This is far too early for another cycle to begin. The rise of their new empress must have spurred them to action. Meanwhile, our scouts report that a massive Mogul army is assembling in the north, in numbers not seen since the days of Lei Shen. With the attention of the Golden Lotus Divine, the Mogu clearly see an opportunity to conquer the Vale and subjugate everyone within. Most troubling of all, though the Vale has been cleansed of the Shah's corruption, a tangible sense of dread lingers in the air. The High Keeper speaks of a looming threat that we are powerless to stop. I cannot draw him out of his malaise. Perhaps you will fare better. Alright. So yeah, this is War Dan. There is no hope. The coming threat will consume us all. You only delay the inevitable. Try as I might, I cannot reach him. There's a new core master too, uh, right here. There's a mount you can get, you can get uh, a bunch of other stuff, like an augment wound that costs 50k gold. 
Uh, you can use that. There's a new pet you can get, but you have to be exalted, and a new incense you can use. So whole new that stuff. And also there's a uh, repel if you want to if you're taking damage. You go to this guy, and then we put your armor. All right, so we gotta talk to Wadan. You have my attention. Alright, talk to him. It can't be coincidence that just when we need help with the Forge of Origination, we find the Keeper who installed it. And uh... You go on ahead. I'll try and talk some sense into him. So we got a new quest. We get some 430 as well, but I don't need it. Okay, now that's just a daily. So... What we need to do is this cannot be. The Black Empire itself has invaded the Vale. Act swiftly before all is lost. Alright. So that is in what? A Kunai Summit again? Uh no, that is in a dungeon, which is in let me see, I think that is it. I believe that's, yeah. It has to be in that dungeon. Uh, yeah, so. To blossom. Alright, so that's inside some sort of dungeon we gotta go to. And you get a new flight path too. Alright, so. It looks like it might be in Mogusham Palace. I believe. Or it could be in the other dungeon. Let me see. If I go into. No, I don't think it's in the Val because you can't get access to it. So yeah, it has to be in Kunai Summit, which is in Mogulshan Vaults. Is that where we need to go? I believe. Okay, so let's go inside. Yeah, let's go inside. Okay, so I'll meet you guys at Kunai Summit again for the dungeon. Okay, so I figured this out. So you do not need to uh, do the entire assault. All you need to do is kill this guy, the leader. Go back to the place you came. And then there's another quest you have to do. So... This is where the map looks like, and there's like a cave. I'll show you the cave once I kill this guy. So let's uh, start killing this guy right now, and see if we can uh, kill him.
Yeah, this should do it now. And... Alright, we got it. Awesome. So now I'll meet you guys back to the uh, place where, where Magni is, and that's where we can continue. Alright, so this is where you have to go to get the. What's it called? The. Conqueror's Trophy. Once you get the crust from uh, over there, you go over there where my arrow is, and then there should be like a, a cave right over here. And then you go down there, kill the final boss, and then you have to come back up, and then you uh, come back over here, come back up again, and then you can. Uh, Start flying and then go back to where you got the crest from, turn it in, and then that's how you uh, get the, the trophy from it. So now we're gonna go back to Magni where where Dan is, and then there should be more crests of that. Alright, so there's where Dan waiting for me. Alright, so before we continue, we want to play real quick. There we go. And that thing is still chasing me. Hopefully it's gonna die in about... Yep, it's dead. Alright, right down. Here you go. So this is as right. Uh, let's get that one, I guess. So, all of the Titan facilities on Pandaria are connected. Ooh. Fascinating. Well, right. no sense standing around while the world is oh, ending. Don't to Palace. Okay, now we go to Mogushan Palace. And that is in Kunai Summit. No, wait, nope. We gotta go back to uh, up there for. Okay. Oh, these guards attack me. I don't know what I did, but I'm getting out of here. Okay, now everything was. Okay, I'm getting out of here now. So I can just get a t if they can if I can get a combat, I can stop flying. Okay, they should be stop uh, f attack me pretty soon. I can just get combat. Hopefully soon. There we go. Okay. All right. So we need to go over there and yeah. So we gotta go and go Mogulshim Palace, the dungeon. That means. There's a bunch of more stuff we need to do in Mogulshan Palace. So that, so we're going back to Pandaria, the dungeon again. Now it's a uh, level 90 dungeon when the expansion first came out. So that dungeon is up here. Alright, there's Mogushan Palace. So we're just gonna drop down and wait no. Change it to normal. There we go and here we go. Alright, we're in. Radan said that the secret passage is hidden beneath the palace. We need to find a way down there. Okay, so these statues are gonna move. Oh become a lava actually, so watch. See? Ah! The statues are coming to life! Right, now we need to Yeah. 
Let's go, champion. Alright. Oh, now, if you guys remember, step, the Moku are known to lead traps for unwary intruders. If you guys remember playing Pandera and doing this, uh, either a quest or some sort of dungeon, there's traps here, so maybe if I can jump. See? You know, we're safe. Jump. Oh, it's actually keeping me alive. Okay, now I kill it. Another one. There's another one I can ride. There's another one coming out. All three statues come out. Okay, so it's junk. Don't need. Ow. That switch must open the way forward. Just watch your step around those tiles. Alright, so we need to be careful. There's traps. So, the only way we can do this is doing this way. So, if you follow these. Oh boy. So if I can just get my way over there, we should be good to go. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go this way. And... Okay, now let that work. Can I go through them? Mm, doesn't look like it. Alright, so we're gonna go back to the beginning then. Okay, so let's try... Okay, so this is a safe spot. The yellow statue. Alright, we did it. We made it to the level. Now I just need to click on it. Once I... Get over there. Ow. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, there we go. A hidden staircase. Yeah. Now everything is perfect. No more traps. Okay, now we'll go to the bottom. Now these things are also back too. Uh, I forgot what they're called. Oh yeah, these lizard things are back. Our world needs us, Ooh, gotta watch out for that next time. Okay, just jump. There we go. Jump. Off the traps. There's another one. Okay, dead. There's another one.
Okay, it was that. And we got a bunch of more down <clears throat> here. I didn't see a way to open the door. There must be a switch somewhere. We best stop searching. Dead, only one survives. And dead. Alright, so the object for this, we have to move uh, only one statue, which is this one. So we're just gonna do this. Nope, yeah, it's this statue we have to move. Okay, so we just do go that. Push. Statue, of course. You've got a sharp mind, hero. Keep moving it to the platform, and done. Easy. I did it. <laughs> now let's see what this passage leads. Maybe we should have brought a torch. It's been a while since I've had to walk. Wait, I think we're here. Now, let's find the engine. What in the name of Azeroth is going on in here? Intruders have breached the vaults. All right, so what we do here, uh, leave none alive. We have to kill. Uh, we have to do the uh, a bonus objective now until we get to 100%, and then. It's So yeah, this is another bonus objective we need to do. So basically, just get the ball to 100% and then you can move on to the next course. It doesn't take that long for this bonus objective, you just gotta click on stuff. So that's 10. Only click on the corruption. So that's twenty. So these mantids don't count. You just gotta kill. I mean, the uh, click on the this, uh the corrupted stuff. That's on the ground. Alright. So that's done. Kill this guy. He's dead. Okay, 53. Azeroth oh, yeah. cries out in pain.
There's that. He's doing this. And this one is... Alright, so three... Almost done. Or almost there at least. Alright, let's go up here now. Now, if you guys remember, there used to be a boss over here where you have to kill... Uh, what's his name? What's his name in this dungeon? Um... Oh, wait, it's a raid. Uh, okay, so here, uh, Fang, yeah. Fang, the accuser. He was the second boss in this raid. Or was it something else? Nope, it was Fang. Yep. Or it could be the spirit king. I don't remember though, it's been a while. So make sure you get all the corruption get the one hundred percent and then you can move on. Alright, that's seventy eight. Eight, almost done. And done. Focus on the engine. Come on. So yeah, two times that Nazoth comes to you when you're doing the cloak quest line. All right, so now I gotta go to the bottom, go downstairs to the secret. Now, if you guys remember, uh, what's his name is Elegon, the another way boss of Mogulshan Watch. He drops a mount. So if you're lucky, you can get it. But it's, a, it's like a one percent job though, so it's not a uh, one hundred percent. Mantid. Okay. Go this way now. And you got more Mantid to kill. Empress will have our heads if the ritual is interrupted. Stop them at all costs. Okay. 
And then up here, we have more mansion to kill. So yeah, over here, there's, that's another boss room. Or another boss room. But you can't go up there over there because the door is locked. Because you were doing the quest line for the cloak. to kill There should be a boss coming up ahead. There's a boss. Be careful of the... Yeah, these things can hurt you. Now there's gonna be a uh, cutscene after you uh, Look kill at the this. Size of that thing. Go for the eye. Now I'm gonna kill the eye. So we just gotta kill the giant eye. Abilities to get them down. Okay, so I'm just gonna focus the eye instead of the other ones. So, yeah, just kill the eye. You should be able to control it. Be uh, on the lockout on your feet. Don't step in that. That thing is dead. Oh, it's dead. Good. Now it is Titan console. Cutscene. There we go. You can use that console to connect us to the Chamber of Heart. Remote link established. Awaiting circuit completion. Hold your horses, lass! This thing didn't exactly come with instructions. Ouch! That stung! Wait! 
It all makes sense now. Connecting the power circuit. What's this? Interesting. I'll remember that for later. There. The link is up. Acknowledged. Rerouting power to Forge of Origination. We did it, hero! The Forge is drawing power from the engine of Nalat Shah. And I found something in the archives that could turn the tide against Nazoth. Come on, let's get back to the High Keeper. Alright, now we're going back to the Chamber of Heart again. Shortcut. So you know what? We're gonna take a uh, quick shortcut. So we're just going to actually no, we don't need to go to the team before. We're gonna go back to uh, that guy. So where's the way out? Is you go through this way and this way. Yeah, this is the way out. Okay. So remember the traps are still there. We may wanna jump. Okay, and then go across. I mean, just go just forward, and then jump. There you go, easy. All right, so now we're getting. Oh, am I? Unless, nope, nope, nope. I'm going the wrong way. Okay, so yeah, that's the wrong way. Jump. Okay, and then we go. This way, so yeah, I went the wrong way. You need to go this way, and then there's a portal to go back. And there we go. This cannot be. The Black Empire itself has invaded the Vale. Act swiftly before all is lost. Alright, now we gotta go back to Nalak. And then to that question, and then after that, you need to go to visit the Black Prince, and then it takes you to Black Rock Mountain. Go to. Uh, what's it? Black. No, it's. Yeah, Black Ring Descent or something like that. Another crack. That crack is in Wade. So yeah, this takes you like an hour or probably a one or two, depending on how uh, your speed is. Alright, go here, turn the crescent, there's where then. Let me repair though. Alright, there we go. An intriguing discovery speaker. If the Mogu have learned how to focus the Forge's energies. Aye, it means we can use the Forge against Nazoth without reoriginating the entire world. Hmm. Perhaps I should observe this myself. Alright. Speak, mortal. So you got a new entrance, that's good. Hope is fleeting. The end prolonged has it been since I last saw the Forge of Origination. Storm Speaker, I leave Nirajani in defense of the engine. As you command, High Keeper. I will take us to the Chamber of Heart. This may prove disorienting. Alright, now going back to the chamber of heart. Such a magnificent facility. It looks to be of Arcadus's make. Odd that I was unaware of its existence. Knowledge of chamber restricted to Sigma level clearance. Proximity to World Soul requires additional safeguards. Aye, 
We only found this place because Azeroth herself showed us the way. Alright, talk to him. Magni. I speak for Azeroth. And Lord Magni's findings. Fight for our world. Before we do that, Back we do work. this. Alright, there's that. Alright, now we can our begin. World needs us, champion. Mother! Can you tell us how to focus the Forge's energies against Nazoth? Affirmative. Precision execution of origination protocol possible via remote triangulation. Successful deployment of calibrated targeting anchors requires proximity to source of contamination. In other words, we need to place these anchors close to Nazoth himself. Which means braving the very heart of the Black Empire. Anyone setting foot inside that accursed place would be driven to madness. There is always a way. The rest of you see to the forge. Leave the problem of Nyalotha to me. Uh, I didn't know what you have up your sleeve, lad. But all right, let's fire it up. All right. These stones have tales to tell. Our world must be here. So we click on the engine. Actually, we need to activate three of them. There's one. Rerouting power from engine of Nalak Shah to inactive systems. All right. Here's the second one. Reactivation sequence initiated. Awaiting user input. And the third one. Talk to mother. Contamination levels. And here we go. Error. Exit routine not found. Restoring Forge of Origination to full functionality. Warning. Unidentified anomaly detected. Anomaly? What do you mean? Talk to Mary again. Azeroth cries out in pain. Uh, looks like we're going to order him again. Remember your duty. Ah, this can he be good. I'll meet you back in Uldum. I need to get closer. champion. This anomaly. See if you can discern its origin. All right. So we gotta go back to Uldum again. Go back to the halls of organization again. And I'll see you guys over there. Alright, so now I'm in Udum again. And we gotta go into this dungeon, Halls of uh, Organization again. To, to find something that we need to do. There's Magni. Mm, nothing unusual out here. I speak for Azeroth. For Azeroth! Alright, so we're gonna enter the dungeon. Look out! The ceiling's caving in! Okay, so we gotta dodge the ceiling. It's starting to fall. The entrance is blocked! Mother, get our champion out of here! Error. Unable to locate suitable destination for extraction. Well then, bring them to me! Hero, I'll meet you outside! Locking onto speaker unit. Teleportation initiated. Mm. 
and then you get teleported. That was too close for comfort. Let's go, champion. Alright, so now I'm gonna climb upstairs. And then, if you see a straight, there's some tornadoes we gotta dodge. So, we also gotta wait for Magni because he's so slow. Look! Oh. Across the sand! That must be the anomaly! Alright. So yeah, we gotta go straight now. Now let's see, would Magni get caught in the tornadoes? Oh no, let's see here. Probably not. Wait! Do you feel that? Something's wrong. Uh 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 Be careful, uh. hero! Yep, yeah, you yeah, okay. He just went through it. But he didn't get any get caught though. Alright, so yeah, we're gonna go to this thing. That's where we need to go. And click it. Uh oh. No. It has already begun. Champion, you must resist Nazoth's influence. Do not give in to madness. Uh -oh. So yeah, this is where the Can you bring them back to the chamber? Now we're back to Chima Hall again. Was that Nazoth's doing? I've never seen anything like it. It was his vision of the future made manifest. An echo of the Black Empire. Well, I did say leave the problem of Nyalotha to me. I suppose now is as good a time as any. Alright. Speak your mind. Speak to the Black Prince. And that is where you get your cloak. So now we gotta go to uh, Black Black Ring Descent in Black Rock Mountain, and that's where you get your cloak from. The Black Dragon Flight. I will rendezvous with my operative outside Black Rock Mountain. Meet me there. All right. So I'll meet you guys in Black Rock Mountain. All right, guys. I'm now in Black Rock Mountain. We're going to Black Ring Descent. And. It appears Nizoth is one step ahead of us. There's Rathian, so we're going to sign Brief up. We'll have to wait. For now, we press on. Yep. Inside the dungeon, we go. There's Rathian. Nazoth's forces have seized Nefarian's lair. Make haste, champion. There can be only one reason they are here. Okay, now we're gonna kill... You will serve the master or die. So the Dark Increaser is a raid boss in the uh, in the raid for the Walking City. 
So that's a way boss that's talking. The suffering they inflict upon these dragons. Ah, the infamous Black Prince. Such an honor to finally meet you. Behold the work of your fallen kin. Fear not. His efforts will not go to waste. Speak to Rathian. These cultists intend to revive Nefarian's experiments. We must stop them. Eliminate the ones conducting the research. I will bring down the barrier. Okay, so Rathian doesn't join you. This is a solo mission. So what we need to do is go visit the two sections. And we need to do something here. Uh, actually, that's, does he follow me? Or this is... Oh no, he's going to the... Okay, so yeah. He's one shot that guy. Watch this. One shot. Boom. One shot. Okay, we're gonna one shot the dragons now. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, he can take it himself. Alright, so let's go here. These guys have refused the alchemy lab to experiment on those wealths. Put a stop to it. Okay, so we're just gonna kill this guy. And dead. Alright, that's one. Now we go to the other side. And then there's more to it after both sides are done. Did uh, Rathian clear the whole room for me? Thank you, Rathian, for clearing the whole room. So, Rathian is. I don't know that where's he at. Uh, he's somewhere. Alright. So, he must have cleared the entire room for me, so thank you, Rathian. Okay, so we're gonna go this way. There's a uh, void void rail. Oh, I'll just like it. If I can, uh, yep, there we go. We just have uh, to avoid that. And now uh, we got more minions to kill.
Oh, we got a uh, damage potion. Excellent. That would be good going handy. It seems that the failed experiments become fodder for that monstrosity. So in the Walking City, the raid, you also get to kill Wrathman too because he got corrupted or something or like a, I don't know how, I don't know, but he's like a raid boss now. The beast is going to be released soon. Now that beast is also from the original Black Wing Blur. This is a weird boss, Black Wing. Alright, now we need to kill this. Legacy will soon be ours. Return to me, champion. This barrier is proving more resilient than I anticipated. Okay. Dodge the wood wrath. And alright. Just gotta go up here. Uh is it an edge? There's like what one, two? Uh, I see one. Wait, does the last thing want to help me kill this guy? No? Alright. There we go. I nearly had it. Just another. Behind you! Uh oh. Here they come. Some more. Here comes a At last, the Black Prince graces us with his presence. The Black Dragon flight was unworthy of the Master's gifts. Can still be a feast. Begin the ritual. The master has summoned me to Nihilus. Our lesser creations can play the prince's companions. Alright. So this father proved incapable of resisting the old gods, little well. Such hubris to think you would fare any better. No! Alright, so we need to uh, kill these things. Yeah, dead. This one. 
Oh, we got January. Okay, now we got two dragons we need to Okay, now we gotta find what. No, what we need to do next is we need to kill uh four of the Dark Whispers. It was Dark uh, Whispers. Three more of the Dark Whispers witch list. Here's another one. Oh, I didn't see this guy. Alright, dead. Let's kill this witch list. Two. Two more to go. Okay, so we we'll just uh, go downstairs. Okay, so there's the boss that's in the dark purple. We need to kill two more of the witch list. One. Right, that's three. One more to go. Which is right over here. There she is. And this is the last one. Alright, and this should do it. Hold on. Cutting. Enough! You cannot break me like you broke my father! The Black Dragon Flight will purge your master from Azeroth! Impudent dragon! All of your kind will bow before Nizar! With me, champion. Let us bring this to an end. Alright. Now we go, uh, talk to Grassian. And... This is part of the cloak. Okay, there he is. Talk to him. I underestimated the sway the old gods still hold over the Black Dragonflight. There was little I could do to resist their power. I will not allow my Dragonflight to be corrupted again. Nefarian's and Onyxia's remains must be destroyed. <clears throat> Re 
recover their scales once it is done. Those, at least, will aid us in protecting Azeroth. Alright. So we're gonna burn the bodies of Onyxia and if okay. Done. Oh, there's the Corp Black uh, Dragon Scale. I entrust the scales to you, champion. Return to the Chamber of Heart, so that we might wield them against Nazoth. Now the good thing is, you don't need to uh, teleport back. You can use this mount, and he'll take you back to the Chamber of Heart. Alright, now we're going back to uh, the surface to the Sea of Magni. Okay, so he's going to take you all the way back to the dungeon. There we go. Now we're in Cephas. Alright. Go to the Chamber of Heart. And now this is the part where we actually get the cloak but we're not done yet after that there's still more to go well not more but there's there one something more you wish to discuss? Okay, so here's a cloak this is more than a mere cloak champion it is all that remains of my once proud dragon flight corrupted by Nazoth in life they will shield you from his influence in death now let us brave his vision once more. So there's one more quest. Every action has consequences. So if you want to see what the cloak actually looks like, it looks like something like that, if you can see it. So it's something, here I'll just uh... So it looks something like that. That's what the cloak looks like. So purple and so yeah. It doesn't do anything special yet until you get it winked up. Maybe I think six I believe or seven, I don't remember what wink. But yeah, that's what the cloak actually looks like. Alright, so now we are gonna talk to mother. Accessing the database. Hello. To the Hall of Illumination. Departure. Alright, now we go up here. Now, remember last time, me and Magni were trying to find something over there. And just so now we got the cloak. Now we can enter the vision and uh, go down there and see what it looks like. Watch for the tomatoes, don't get hit. Alright, there we go. Well, we're now to the vision. Now we're gonna enter it. It's too far away. The cloak will protect you from the brunt of Nazoth's power, but it cannot hold him at bay indefinitely. Do not tarry. So we got. Uh, okay, so this is what the bard uh, says. If you hover your mouse on it, it says. Sanity. This. The, the, vo the vision and the. Uh, these agents are such a city. When your city reaches zero, you can only revive if an ally donates their city through the city resuscitation orb or through Titan Elevation. So, if you're doing a vision and you can die if, uh, if you have something kind of above from the research, so be careful of the 
bar because when it's reached zero you can die and then you have to start over again. Oh. The deeper you delve into Nizoth's vision, the stronger his influence becomes. Even with the book, your sanity will erode more quickly, and your senses will begin to betray you. Good. So I gotta be careful. Uh, let's, yeah, let's dodge those. We don't need to kill them. Alright. Dodge this one. And. Beware the creature ahead of you. Its attacks afflict not only your physical form, but your mind as well. <laughs> So we just need to kill the tentacle. And that's it. Alright, here we go. Stop okay. Oh god, watch out for that. Watch out for that. Okay, there we go. Oh no no. So yeah, watch out for that stuff. This is gonna be yeah. Alright, here comes another one. Here comes another one. And another one. This one's almost dead. And it's dead. It's over. This vision must center around the forge. Perhaps repairing it will end the nightmare. Head for the control chamber. Alright. Uh, third floor, I believe? Or was it the second floor? I think it's the third floor. Nope, keep going. There we are. Champion, look at the console. Nizoth never meant to destroy the forge. He seeks to corrupt it. Gonna kill this. So you can't join the scenario. It's a solo one only. So you have to do it by yourself. Forge belongs to the Mother, Lost. see if you can bring our champion back to the chamber. We have much to discuss. And now we're going back to the chamber. Alright, there's a teleporter. Teleportation device activated. Alright. See you soon, mother. Alright. the engine of Nalak Shah to power the well forge met. of origination. 
fight for Our our world. Incredible. The level of expertise that would require. You are most impressive. Initiating commendation reception protocol. Thank you. I would appreciate the opportunity to converse with you further on the matter. Scheduling conversation for next available cycle. Please stand by. Oh, yes, of course. Alright, let's pick the Rathian. We meet again, champion. And you get uh, 2,000 off of power. And then you get some full 30 gear. Hooray! Azeroth faces many threats. And by doing that is... Uh, by doing a vision. Which is over there. Alright. So let's go do a vision real quick. So I'll meet you guys into the vow. Alright, so now I'm at the part where you have to do a vision. So to do a vision, you click on this guy, we will persevere. accept this daily. And you get 3k of class vision and one of the spirit for it. You need three of those to combine the essence. We will have justice. Okay. We're gonna enter it. And here we go. So we're Zoth would see this nightmare become reality. Explore the area, but do so with caution. Champion, I await your return. Ooh, what is which half my insane due to that? Okay, so not to do that again. Alright, so we need to fill this bar to 100%. Hopefully, it doesn't take that long. Oh, sweet, a buddy. Thank you, buddy. My goods are crafted with great care. Nine. Tell me of your trouble. Twelve. Oh, yes. Let's see if we can get this boy up. If we can. Yeah, let's go up here and kill some enemies. There we go. Yes, yes. this guy okay good it's been reset so I think I'm gonna follow this dude and uh, see if he can uh, oh I'm at 30% of insane might want to hold this up Uh 
なんだそう、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、Okay, if I can rescue a couple of these people, I can get some insanity back. See? We get a couple coming back. But that's not that much, though. Only some we get. Alright, so I'm at 67%. We're almost done. Delete this since I have it. Okay. Alright, so I'm at 67%. I just need a few more. Uh, here, let's rescue these citizens. Oh no, that dude got it. Okay, hurry up. You need something? Okay, uh, just need a few more. Insanity. Hold on, hold on that. Okay. Maybe this. So, oh boy, seven points. There's many here. There's a couple of citizens I can probably get. Alright, there we go. Let's move Sammy back. Live longer. Uh, go. Alright, that ninety-eight percent. Okay, we're done. Now just need to get out of here. Up before I die. Okay, knock him out. Alright, now we gotta get out of here. So we gotta go back to where I came from. Go to the. To just click on this, and we're done. Now that was really close. Right there. That's how you do the vision. This cannot be. The Black Empire itself has invaded the Vale. Alright, now we'll go back lost. to. The heart of Ezroth. We're gonna take the Hearthstone to make it easy. Alright, go back to the Chamber of Heart. Go visit, I think it's Mag. No, it's Rathian. Done. All right, here you go, Rathian. Here's the vision I just did. You stand before the Black Prince. Uh, sure. We'll just take the boots, I guess. Speak with the mountain stars, the gateway. Learn from the past. Look to the future. Okay, I'm gonna disenchant that real quick. Don't need that. 
Contamination levels. Uh, no yes. Error. Exit routine. The Forge of Origination was built to remake Azeroth according to the Titan's design. But if Nazoth corrupts it, he could use the Reorigination Protocol to transform Azeroth into the Black Empire. We must bolster your cloak's resistance to Nazoth before you enter Nihilotha. And we will turn his own scheme against him in the process. Okay, we need to activate this. Gateway construction complete. I have been expecting you. So now, if you have, uh, let's see, how many do I have? 8,783. So you, what you need is... Uh, 10,000 to buy a vessel and you can start doing the visions and you can start soloing it to get your cloak up to at least wink 6 or yeah wink 6 and then you have to do like a uh, front and group to get it all the way up so for this week well for Tuesday it's gonna be 11 but this is for 10 for this week so this week is gonna go to 11 Enter a vision to discover the dark of Nazoth. Until next time, by entering Nazoth's vision on our own terms, we can push the limits of your cloak in a relatively safe environment. Okay, so we can buy a vessel. We need now. only introduce a nominal amount of corruption into the chamber to link our reality to Nihilotha. A nominal amount? Lad, have you lost your mind? We'll be doing Nazoth's work for him. I admit that this is a risk, but it is one that we must take. Mother can cleanse the corruption once our champion returns. Alright, so I'm going to show you guys how this works. So we're going to enter the vision. So you can queue by yourself or you can queue with other people. With five, you can only queue for f uh, five people if you want to do it with a group. No way, group, just five. Driven mad by Nazoth's whispers, Thrall believes that the elements warn him of a disaster that only the old god can prevent. Now all of Orgrimmar drinks the blood of Nazoth, twisting the horde into a frenzied war machine. You stand before the Black Prince. Alright, so once you hit that, your vessel will be gone, which is right there. Alright. Here we go! So all I really gotta do really is kill all the trash, get to the main boss and boom boom. And then time too, so you don't have much time. Let's take this shit now. Go. These corrupted things to kill these guys. Okay, there we go. Take these guys out. Oh boy, that would be much time. Oh boy.
Uh-oh. Okay, let's go a few of them so we get some help. Oh, now I got a slime out of me. Okay. And now I'm going to take damage. Uh oh. Yeah. Okay, so I might not make it. I do not want to do this. But that goes. Okay. Now I'm going to. Okay, at least in the way I can. Yeesh. Oh, no wonder what's happening. This stupid chain is coming out. Alright, uh, probably not gonna make it then. Okay. Oh, crap. So, I just need to get to the boss. Hopefully, I can reach him. Oh, here's Thrall. And I'm dead. Okay, so that didn't go too well. The blood of the old is our only salvation. Well, yeah, that's how the vision goes, though. And then you collect the reward. Our sorties into Nazoth's mind place you in immense peril. We must push further into the visions, but not if we lose you to madness in the process. And then you go through the door. Exit. Voila. That's how it goes. Speak your mind. Azeroth the faces door many threats. Opens. The path made clear. That voice! Where is it coming from? And find the source. To tell. Uh, talk to... Who? Mother? Oh no, it's the eye. Here it is. The sleeping city awakens. The Black Empire reborn. We're under attack! Protect the chamber! I need to kill everything now. Now if you die, you can, it takes you back to the... To over there. Which you can die. Which I'm gonna die shortly. See? Now if you die, you come back here.
are what anchor him here. We need to destroy them. Forty percent. Forty four, fifty two, sixty. Almost there. Ninety-six, and this should do it. One hundred. All right, there we go. Good scene. He's gone. If Raden has been pulled into Nyalotha, Nazoth's vision made real, then I do not envy his fate. Okay, so if you click on Rathian, uh, he, uh, he gives you a quest to to to, uh, to get your cloak up. So if you keep doing this quest every day, or actually every week, you can get your cloak up every uh, week once it's up. And then this one says, uh, "Speak to Mother Dragon of Titanic Research." Never let your guard down. The okay, Black Dragon. To Magni. Azeroth cries out in pain. Speak to his mother, Chamber of Heart, location. Remember your duty to Azeroth. Do you require extended uh, to check my Dan. Departure acknowledged. We need to save him. Mother, can you find us another way inside? Acknowledged. Scanning planetary surface for related anomalies. Matching energy signature detected. Location, Veil of Eternal Blossoms. Of course, the Titan Forges. Hold on, Raden. We are coming for you. All right. I speak for Azeroth. He gives you a free vessel. And then they want us to defeat Nazoth in the new raid. Alright. So 
I'll do this later, not right now. Speak to mother. Uh, Compiling recorded Titan research. Data archive now accessible. All right. So this costs 100. So if you choose this, in horrific versions, unable sanity resorts or abuse, the orb resides all nearby allies and restores the insanity. Up to three insanity resources and orbs can be summoned in a single vision, and orbs summoned by any player in the party counts against this limit. So if you keep using this research, this can help you in visions to keep you or your group alive and you can loot bodies and some other stuff too. And I think that should do, do it. Experimentation? And there you guys have it! That is the long quest line and how to obtain your legendary cloak. And sorry if this took too long guys, but I want to sh uh, show you if you're coming back to the game or coming back from a very long time and want to try the patch out and hope this guide will uh, help you how to uh, obtain your cloak so thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time see ya hello everybody Evil Dewey Master here and thank you very much for watching this video on how to obtain this legendary cloak from patch 8.3 and I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up or a like. And make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. And click the bell so you can see more uploads on the channel. And follow me on Twitter at EvilDealMaster. And follow me on Facebook at EvilDealMaster. And also follow me on, face on Twitter, I mean uh, Twitch at EvilDealMaster for more live streaming. And make sure you give me more questions. You can put them in the comments below. You can also put them on Twitter, Facebook, and also my Discord server as well for a future Q&A video. So anyway guys, I'm going to be signing off. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya.